Welcome to Take a Step to a Better You. Today I want to show you how you could use $50 to promote your YouTube video with the goal of finding new customers where your real people are. The intention here for me sharing this is you use this method to really find out where the people who like your videos are which country, which age, because later you come in analytics and it will show you who really liked this. But you're going to use $50 to do this. Now, uh, it's called Sp uh, Spreezy. Right now I'm, I'm on my YouTube uh, channel. I'm the homepage here. And I'm going to show you how the steps you take to, to promote your video. Step by step. So watch me. Here I'm, going, I'm choosing to promote this video this one so but you to uh Spritzy offers you to search your channel but for me to make sure i'm choosing the right video i'm promoting the right video i like to pick it so here this one it's called traffic sources and the link watch as i go the link is right here this is a link i want to promote that's the video so i copy that that's how i do it but there could be another way to do it and then i go to Spritzy now Right here below this video that you're watching, I have a link. You know, I promote Spreezy, but I also like to share the good thing about it. I wrote, I have, I think, three videos already where I showed you more about my results. I'll link all of them in this description. But for now, I, I, before I didn't show you how you set it up. So today I want to show you how you set it up. So we came, I picked the video. It's right here. I got a link. It's, uh, I copied like this. I copied the link. Now I'm going to Spreezy. This is Spreezy. When you click on my links, the one I put in the description, they'll get you here. But, but because you don't have, I'm assuming you don't have an account with them yet, so you have to sign up here. You can read about them, uh, how it works, contact us. I have a, one of the videos I have, I, I read all that. I went through all the questions. But today, I want to show you how to set it up. So I'm going to log in because I already have an account. I already have my copied link so watch i'm logging in you can't see my password <laughs> so i get here now when i get in here because i have some other videos i'm going to uh don't worry about the rest just watch yours will be empty when you get here so it says promote a new video here you click here promote new video and when you click on promote video, new video, it says search within your channel, Sherifa Nakalima, which is my channel, but I'm, I don't like the searching. For me, I like to come with my link, okay? So, and then for those people who promote other companies or you have more than one channel, here you have to select the channel, the channel you are promoting. For me, it's just one, okay? So assuming you deal with more than one channel, so you have to uh, to promote, to pick which, which channel we are dealing with and search uh, they say search. I don't search. I like to come with my link. So I brought it here, the video. Remember, you saw me pick it up. So after I put in there, I search. I search uh, they are searching now for that video, the one I showed you. See, they got it. So now they're going to show you what it looks like. The people on YouTube, how they see it. See? That's how it shows up as an ad. Traffic sources, average view duration, and, and uh, your na name of the channel, but it shows that it's an ad. You see how it has skip ad? Those ads you skip, when you're annoyed, they come up. So I'm going to set it up here. And because you are starting out, when you create your very first video, they're going to, you're going to see something that I'm not seeing here. They ask you, okay, do you want, are you promoting a song? Do you, what do you care about? I'm um, saying so what they ask when they ask what you care about. I'm um, suggesting for the purpose of this video, likes. No, no, no. Okay, likes. Not not likes and comments. Views and subscribers. Views and subscribers. The views are guaranteed. They cannot charge you when a view is not has not happened. And they they have reports on here. But today that's not what I'm covering. If you have any questions, please put in the comments. Um, but it's very very clear if you take the time to understand this. But today I want to just show you how you promote your video. So you set it up, you choose, please choose views and subscribers. 
when you choose likes and this I, I feel like why should you pay money for that if the view your video is good people are going to like it and comments ask them for comments but the views and subscribers that's what we want they guarantee the views but they cannot guarantee subscribers the reason i'm suggesting that you use this service to discover who is subscribing who is liking your video you can choose you see how i'm setting this up so let's go i already put the link i already explained to you that you're going to choose at least for me that's what i have an experience with views subscribers okay or just views but i think views and subscribers are together so you come here you choose the language i'm choosing english uh, the, the video is in English and here they ask you write your own YouTube ad or they write it for you so for this purpose because you can choose that they write for you all you have to do is give them the video but you lose like a day so if you want I'd like to build and write my own ad expected uh, the, the, the approve it faster so that's what I'm going to choose just also to show you how you can write your own ad uh, okay remember you have to remember the title they already picked up the title here the title from my youtube channel said traffic sources for youtube youtube average view duration that's how I I named it how long do viewers watch that was too long okay but I care about traffic sources and average view duration that was the main message in that video you make sure it's relevant or people are not gonna like it so I'm choosing to write my own ad so here the headline is traffic sources is what I'm going to call it uh, YouTube traffic sources YouTube that's what I was explaining in the video YouTube traffic sources and See here, I'm going to describe it. See your or see traffic sources for your video. That's what I was teaching. And then here they are limiting you on this side. It has two sides: this side and that side. So this side has 34 out of 35 characters maximum. So I'll stop there. But then they are saying description one and description two can be one continuous sentence so what i write here and what i write here they'll combine them together so i said see uh the space will not show when the ad shows up so see traffic sources for your video i'm stopping there because i'm limited with space and then on the other side i say uh no i'm going to uh, no average i'm just creating this right now average view duration because that those are the two messages i had in that video i have 35 characters here so i could make it longer no your no the i could say no the average oh it's finished no average so i wrote that already no average view duration maybe no your how is your average view duration i could make it a question actually how is your if it allows it yeah how the is your average view duration i don't know if they allow question marks i haven't used them let's try it okay see traffic sources for your video how is your average view duration maybe i should not capitalize just leave it sorry i'm changing the capitals uh, I, I was writing like i like on youtube but we are here average view sorry slow average view duration that's a keyword by the way when you are writing these make sure you are picking up on the keywords that are important even okay i finished the description now this is very very important when you get to this section here at least from my testing when you you choose these it's hard to come and change them back it's better not to select them than selecting them and want to unselect them later so let me show you what 
at least my understanding. When you see these, they are labeling them. Okay, when people search, they search for search for discovery. Discovery means you are Spreezy. You know Spreezy is connected with Google. So the this partner up with Google. So it's actually Google doing the promotion. So they use discovery. So discovery, they throw out your video and see who is uh, who is responding. But these commercial ads, these commercial ads, you may choose not to use them at the beginning because what happens, you know how someone is, is on, on YouTube and an ad shows up, those skippable ads, like the way they show up, they're annoying to some people. So they warn you if you get to read in here that you may get dislikes on your video uh, more, than, uh, more than normal. No more uh, higher than normal dislikes because of this of these commercial ads. So you could remove the commercial ads. You could remove those and then let they, them promote it in other ways. If you remove the commercial ads, you get less traffic, but you get more more of the people who like to click on the video. But the commercial ones they bring you faster faster. Uh, people, I mean, for faster traffic, you see that it's busy, it's a busy video. So for this purpose, for me, I'm going to leave them on. But as you are testing, you could say no, and then later you can come and edit it and put them on. But what I tested is that when you leave them on like now, it's hard to come and, and check them. So when you're starting out, you could leave out the commercial ads and do the rest. Uh, okay, and they have notes here what they all mean to make a video not too long I don't want to go read all that you can come and read it. So targeting now. This is where the game becomes very very either interesting or not interesting because Here you see they're connected with Google. You can choose who you want to watch your videos If you know that maybe females like your message you can remove the males and just focus on females. If you know uh, you don't want young people and older people, you want the middle, middle age, you can unselect all these. See? But for my purpose, I'm leaving everything selected. For me, I don't care that much. But if you know who you want to target, you can choose uh, those selections. And then here's what I emphasize more when you hear me speak. The country. This is where you choose which country you want. Now, for me, especially for these YouTube tips, I would focus on USA. But you can so now when you so you, you watch the screen, what happens? If I choose to show to people in all countries, you see a warning comes up. Are you sure you want to target people in all countries? Recently, I tested something. I tested something. I said, let me put it in all countries. For the first time, I did it. Actually, it didn't turn out to be a bad thing because it helped me to see who's reacting to the message and then later you can target those countries that responded well to your video. But it's going to be very expensive. If you do that, your perfect $10 is going to disappear in one hour. So be careful about that. So I wanted to show you the, how they warn you. But otherwise, just go in here. Let's assume, okay, I have United States because I use that a lot. Let's see uh, that I want to add United Kingdom. Wait, wait, United, United, you just search for countries. So United Kingdom is right here. Let's assume I wanted to add that. Every country you select comes up, add zone, add zone. But for today, I don't want so many because I'm, I'm, I'm doing YouTube tips. Not everyone is interested in that. So I just do just those two countries. Now for you, you may be thinking, what worked for me were people who are likely to be attracted to your kind of video are the ones where do they live where do you think you test it out here you can put as many countries 10 15 whatever but it will be best to test one at a time one at a time in fact let me do that so it's not confusing to you. so one at a time because when we test one at a time you can come here and edit you can edit the video you say okay today i tested the united states Let's run it for a day and see what happens. Then tomorrow you come and remove United States and put another country because you are trying to see how people are reacting. Okay? Now, are you promoting a song or band? Oh, this is what I was talking about. Yes. Are you promoting a song or band? No. 
Then they ask you which keywords, phrases describe your video. These are the ones that are already in YouTube. The ones they are populating here, those are the ones, but you are free to add them, to change them. Edit, you can edit them. Let me show you. You can edit. And here you, you remove some, you add more, you update. Or you can just leave the ones, if you are very happy with the, the keywords you had in Google, in YouTube, then it's fine. But here you can add a few more if you want. Okay. And then they have here, you can choose, select channels or videos that are most similar to your own. If you know there is a, a, a channel you want to target to have your videos on, you can put it on here. But also they can, they can have this option, get placements from keywords. Because of those keywords that you put here, you can they can place you on channels that have similar keywords. Or you can ignore all this. If you think this is all complicated, especially if you don't know about keywords and how they work, you can just continue here you, you, to the next step. But for those who care about the keywords because they match your video better, then you click here, get placements from keywords. And guess what they do? They bring channels that have those keywords or oh, see this and you are free to choose for me i look like right here and see you see how many views and their videos i don't like that one you remove it if you don't like that you remove it okay think media do you want to promote on think media or do you want to promote you see how many videos they have how many views they have i don't like this one look it's only no i don't like that you remove uh maybe you don't i don't like those with little like few views okay five views nine two views i remove that sometimes depending on what you are promoting for me they brought a few there'll be a long list so i'm choosing just these channels uh, they can promote on those in addition to others okay then the next step is budget now you have to put this is how your ad is going to look like uh how much now because you are new because you are new they're going to ask for a minimum of 50 right here because i've used them before the minimum is 30. you see that and then sometimes they give a promotional code especially now if you use my link they'll give you uh some promotion in fact you get some few 150 free views i think and then you you get a code also to to share with others to get free views you see that because you are starting out and then they have this something else they do here they say increase your budget by 170 to get to for 10 percent more views this is what they mean they want you to get to 200 dollars let's assume i don't advise this if you're starting out but let's assume you're very happy on the second round you can increase your budget like right here if, if you can say uh increase if you increase it to what they're saying one by 170 remember i said 30 when they say 170 they mean make it 200 so if you make it 200 if you accept this you will see that instead of 200, remember the 10% they're talking about, they give you 220. Instead of, uh, if you accept the offer, they give you 10% more. They put it in real money. Okay, but I'm not doing that. So, uh, just show the $30, what I'm spending. And they say start immediately when the, uh, start immediately and when the budget is depleted or set a future debt. Now, they say most users choose to start their campaigns immediately, but if you wish to time your promotion with the launch of a product, grand opening, or event, select a future date. So you can stay scheduled for later. For me, I'm going to say start immediately. And then delivery speed. Uh, how long would you like your campaign delivered? I say, okay, no more three to seven days. I say faster, one to two days. While we can't guarantee it, we'll attempt to deliver all of your views in your selected time frame. Okay, assuming you, are, you have a specific time. For me, it doesn't matter. So I say faster, just start, then save and continue. Now you're going to, to, to pay. So you pay, they have many ways of paying. Uh, for me, because I paid here already, the card is saved. So I'm, I have a few cards here. I'll select one, that one. I'm charging $30 on that and but if you are new you have to set it up but they save it okay you can even use paypal for those of you you see paypal here as an option and they also have a wallet option so process i'm processing 30 dollars from my account 
and then it says a member of the Spreezy team will review and approve your campaign shortly. Most campaigns are approved and, uh, and live within one business day. I want uh, to earn, well, remember the free views I was talking about? You want to earn free views, send your referral URL to your fellow YouTuber creators. So this, they will give you a, 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 a link to share, like this one. And then if you copy that, anyone you give, they earn uh, 150 free views. Okay, so share your referral link. No, I'm not doing that. And now I can go to my campaigns. Now you see what happens. Up here it says all of them, all the campaigns you have, those who are active, finished, pending, rejected, archive. You know, they could reject your campaign. Because what happens, this is a campaign I just set up. And it's under pending. If I go to pending, it's right here. And you know why this question mark me says your campaign is now pending review by our team. This process can take up to 24 hours. Please check your email in case of any questions. But guess what happens after they approve? They approve really quickly actually. They will approve in a few hours, except if it's a weekend or night. And then what happens next? Google has to approve it. Google is very very strict. So the next step will be, you get an, um, a, a message saying, YouTube is now, did I say YouTube? No, Google. Google is approving your ad. It will may take up to two, 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 one to three days. That's what you get. But if it's a straightforward topic, Google will approve also in, a, in like a day. But if you are dealing with things, like us who deal with affiliate marketing, stuff like that, they have to really, sometimes they watch the video. They check out the video, make it, make sure it doesn't break rules and all that. That's Google. And then when it's approved, it become active. And when it's active for the very first time, I don't I don't I can't say that here because I don't have a, a, uh, one like that. They will say discovery, like they're trying to discover, 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 discover it views to see who is really clicking on it. Uh, you see reports, so reports will be like right here. The reports you go here, you see reports. You have to check which which video you want to check. Like see, I have these. It will be right here. Check which one, and they'll show you that, and they'll show you a report. And then you see how everything is going. This is my conclusion. See, pending review. By the way, you can edit things. See, like here. Maybe I could take you through this. Uh, edit. Be careful. Here you could make a mistake when you click like right here, these come, you could end your campaign by accident right here, but edit. Let's assume I changed my mind on the things I just did. You can do like this later, anytime you can edit this. You go back and all those settings, especially the setting of, most of the setting will be here on the targeting. You go back and find it and then say, you know what? Mm -mm. Let me target only females. Or let me take it. You can change this anytime, anytime. And the country, you can say, okay, let me change that. You just remove it and then put another one. So you are free to do this anytime. You can change countries, uh, but of course you don't want to change it too much because you make you your ad is running. You keep changing countries, but I want to show you how that would work. You know, USA, you USA is. Oh, United States. Yeah, United States was mine. So I came just to show you how you could change it. Okay, you can change any of these settings and then the budget too. And then you come back and save it again. This editing can happen anytime. Although it's even when it's running. Okay, even when you add it active, you can come in here and change it. Okay, I don't have any active. I have a pending one, that one, and I have finished ones. Okay, that's my video. Be below this, in the description, I have a link. Please use my link because I just took my time to show you all this, right? Use my link. It benefits me a little bit. If you use it to get here, share it with others, if you know anyone who wants to promote. And then after you come in here, you're going to get a free uh, that those free views also to share with others. Okay? So I think you are offered the free ones when you first come in to create your account using my link. I uh, haven't talked to people what they see when they click on it, but some people have used it and have benefited from this. 
So that's my video. Again, if you want the details, let's where I show you inside the statistics when I first used it and what happened. Uh, I have the, those three. I have three videos in in the description. To you can go if you want to see what I was sharing then. But the main point is, if your issue is views, you'll get the views. Those are guaranteed. But take time to study to see how people are reacting. Who is leaving? Mostly. They, they're going to subscribe, but they, you get the views, and some are going to leave comments. If they leave comments for you, you know those are very, very excited. So keep switching it, and then after you pay $50 at the beginning, the next video, you only pay uh, $30 to start a new one. You pay only $30 to bring in a new video. But when you are still on, if you see that this video is not doing really well for you, after it's, it's spent like $15, you can, you can end it. Like right here it's the it's the bottom the bottom selection you end it and it be an archived video and then you go in and bring another one because you have $35 left now the next video can start at 30 you, you have a balance in your wallet of the 35 so all you have to do is it takes five minutes to refund it and then you don't choose refund just end the video when you end it the money stays in the account or you can choose to just refund it to the way it came from from your card or wherever you paid from it can go back so i think spreezy is good for some people for some videos and it's going to help you see who is reacting to your message it's good for testing okay that's my video please leave a comment for me what do you think try it out and see how it goes don't overspend test 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 and see how it works for you check it after you just started your campaign, check it to see how people are responding. You come in here and look at the reports. Of course, you're going to be seeing your channel too. What's going on? By the way, when they are reporting, they're showing all the results in your account, in the, your YouTube account. So they bring all of it here. It could be confusing because they don't separate it. By the way, you have to link your channel. I didn't mention that. For them to do this work for you, you have to trust them. But they have a partnership with uh, Google. So you trust them. You have to link your channel before anything can happen okay leave a comment for me what do you think is this helpful like i always end them i do other things by the way if you watched only this video i do business tips money tips affiliate marketing animal online i do motivation i drive around in usa um in virginia usa so please check out my channel i just do these youtube tips because i think they help some people but that's not my main message okay like i always end them i say take very good care of yourself take very good care of your families Take very good care of your health. Try out Spreezy. You can spend just $20. You'll see if it's helping you or not. Please use my link. I benefit when you do that. It's in the description below. Uh, take a step to a better you. Bye-bye.